Hello and welcome to In Motion version Xbox Live. Now I know, I know. I promised that the next installment of In Motion would be a full-length feature, but there was one last thing that Stuart and I needed to test to see if the future would be plausible, and the entire future hinged on this working or not. Fortunately for you, the future has survived since this seemed to work. There was like only one guy talking. He kept like, "Come on, guys, talk! I know you have microphones. Talk!" Talk, you douche fuck nuts! I'm like, this is not a good way to get people to talk. So then I finally, I finally started talking. I was like, sorry, no so good English, huh? He's like, what? No, speak English. He said, no, no, it's not so good. This short episode is all about the final step in this process, which is bringing in more than one person across a great distance. In this case, it was Stuart and I banding together over Xbox Live Party Chat to do some Horde mode in Gears of War 2 as the test. Now, the entire session actually took over an hour for just 10 levels at normal difficulty, and I attribute this to the fact that I've been jumping around from FPS to FPS with wild abandon. I mean, there's Dead Space, Halo 3, Left 4 Dead, and the Gears of War 2. It's just crazy. I, I can't keep up with the control schemes. But all in all, I think the test was successful. Oh my god, there's another one! Put yours down. Because I totally dealt the most damage. Retro on your six! Oh wait, my one. Make that my one. Can we get a little more specific? Like, can I get like retro? 11.45! Quarter to noon! <laughs> Stuart's out of the conversation is recorded with the video capture device since the audio from my TV is routed into my computer. How we got this to work is you set your Xbox Live preferences for any conversation to go through the speakers in your TV and through your headset. And once again, since the audio from my TV is captured, it gets captured. Just like that. Simple as pie. My side get captures, gets captured by record pad. Which means I have to wear yet another headset while I'm doing this. It's great. Having found a good way to sync our audio, I've noticed that the supposed delay isn't a factor since we're both using chat. We found this when we were using our phones and chat at the same time because, I don't know, we didn't hang up. In which our phones would communicate first and then it would come over our headset, maybe about half a second later. It's not an actual leg that stems from connection issues or server problems, it's just not like nanosecond precise. It's more like millisecond precise. It's not a big thing, and when you're both using chat, it's you, you don't even notice it actually. Oh God! Thank you. I'm getting used to the reversed audio since it doesn't wildly screw me up anymore, but at the same time, I'd like to reorganize things so I'm not entangled in wires anymore. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to set the audio to be recorded into my desktop behind me, and then I'm going to set the video to be recorded into my laptop in front of me, that way my audio isn't actually reversed anymore. It's great. So I know I promised, again, that I would have a full episode, and I'm really hoping that next time I will have a full feature length episode for you. I really like to do one. So cross your fingers, hope for the best, and hope that no other tests come up. In the meantime, this is your indomitable host, Zanchi, signing off of In Motion, the Xbox Live special. Sayonara.